Mr. President, IDEO, together with the European Center for Democracy and Human Rights and Arabian Rights Watch Association, call the Council's attention to the serious violation of human rights and the laws of war in Yemen, and urge the Council to work towards providing a recommendation to the UN Security Council to act under Chapter 7 of the UN Charter to transfer the case to the International Criminal Court for crimes under its jurisdiction that are alleged to have been committed by any and all parties to the armed conflict. Mr. President, on March 27, 2015, one day after the start of the war against the people of Yemen, a coalition of 34 Yemeni NGOs submitted a complaint to the International Criminal Court expressing their concern about the commission of crimes by the Saudi coalition as airstrikes struck civilians in their homes. As the days bore on, more and more civilians were targeted and killed by airstrikes and by a comprehensive blockade under the false cover of Resolution 2216 that put a chokehold on the entire population of 27 million Yemenis. On April 28, 2015, local Yemeni NGOs submitted substantiated information supplement supplementing the initial communication to the ICC. In the complaint, the NGOs detailed horrific crimes of egregious proportion being committed against the Yemeni people, alleging war crimes, crimes of aggression, and genocide, as well as crimes against humanity. The NGOs named as defendants, all members participating in the Saudi-led coalition, and called for an, investiga an investigation into all crimes alleged to have been committed by any and all parties to the conflict. As the months continued, so did the serious violation of the laws of war, including gross violations of human rights and international human humanitarian law. The local NGOs continued to update the ICC with substantiated information of the crimes being committed against the Yemeni people. And on September 7, 2015, the ICC responded and agreed to have the prosecutor expeditiously analyze all the claims to decide whether there is a reasonable basis to proceed with an investigation. Mr. President, it has been six months since the last communication from the ICC, and it is our understanding that meaningful analysis will take time. For this reason, we urge the Council to work towards making a recommendation to the UN Security Council to act under Chapter 7 of the UN Charter to transfer the case to the to the ICC for crimes under its jurisdiction.